your red and then blue child in the middle and color in your tongue. You make it really bold. Um, we're gonna try and make it really bold. You don't have to. So that you, so that you can see. Sort of sticking out from the bottom. <laughs> And then we're gonna get out a marker again, a marker, and we're gonna retrace the wrinkles. Okay. And again, and color that in. Color that in. Now I'm eat. I'm gonna do that on the other side now. So once you've done it, you're gonna go ahead and get out your pink and color in the nose and the ears. We're gonna do it pretty boldly so you can see. Really dark and also so it looks cool. And add in not the fur in the ears, just because the fur is gonna be more grey. And if you had done that, don't go threat, it's fine. Don't right? stress, you mean. Don't stress. It's fine. It will look okay. And then also the outside. You can see it like that. Or you can get your marker colour in a little bit of the outside. Yeah, I'm going to get my marker colour in a whole bit. No, just the first part. Just the first part over here. I'm just coloring the top. Um, I did this. And now I'm going to get out my grey color in the other side. And we're I'm going to color in the whole bottom. Actually, don't get out your grey. The grey bits are going to be fast, going to go really fast. No, at the end we're going to have in the grey, but the ear grey is okay. It's okay. And also the hair here. Yeah. Now, the most important part is his fur. Gold! So this part we're not going to fast forward because you need to be able to see it. And you're going to... We're going to make it dark so you can see it. And so it looks cool. Mainly because it looks cool. But also, we want you to be able to see it. When you've done a... So, we're going to go keep on going. It's going to look more like a ball cap. And remember, just do it in spotty areas. And a bit down on his foot, if you did it like me. But not at the bottom. Because at the, the bottom is where we're going to our grey. I I made it like that so you're gonna do your beard in grey. Sort of electric when you rub. Don't forget. So I'm gonna first go ahead and Color this bit, and then I'm gonna put my. Well, we don't down. actually need our serviette. No, I will. I'm gonna use my serviette now. Hold it down. Actually, I'm not gonna really need my serviette because I don't need a lot. It's really smudge, but I can feel how it's gonna smudge if I do it. And then when we're done, will you get out our orange and we'll. Shade in, we'll shade over. Shade over a little bit of places, like under his eye, to make a little dark shadow. I work shading as well the pencil. Because I was pressing too hard. But not in his wrinkles over here, right? Mm -hmm. Try not to get there. If you do, don't stress. It will look okay. Actually, try get the. Mm, a bit of the ring, the top wrinkle. 
didn't draw a very good top wrinkle, but I'll do it in here. Like that. And like that. Like that. Kind. Yeah, and then I'm going to keep on going with my gold. Can you get the Yours is more the yellow than gold, but I call it gold. What? I call it gold. Our bobcats are going to look amazing. It's a totally different drawing when it's coloured. See? We made it a big face. Oh, I broke it. I'll pick this one. Just colouring. Okay. Now... Get out your orange. Get out your orange. Shade it under in, the eyes. Shade it in like the bit of the eyes. And then also like around them. Around I, the eyes. I drew, I'm going to shade in this place. And I'm going to get it in, in here. Like that. And then also up at the top, you might want to get some orange. And then like down with the cheeks, shaded in near the cheeks. My orange doesn't stand out that well. But mine does it. But it's okay. It's mainly around the eyes. Oh, it's orange. Can yeah. you pass me that orange for a second? For a second. Just to make it stand out a little bit more. So now what we're gonna do is it's a, gonna now we're gonna do it a little bit fast. We're gonna color in some gray, not the whole bit, just pretty light. No, pretty dark, but just to give it a bit of a shadow, like also in the bit of the wrinkles and the teeth. Teeth, yeah. Well, we actually meant we're gonna do it near the end because it's not. This is not that fast. And a little bit in the wrinkles around here. You can match it. You can match our colors at the end. Like usual. So, if you have fun drawing your bug cat. I hope yours turned out well. And we'll put ours back down on the desk. It looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Yeah. Bobcats are one of my favorite cats. Good job. Good job. High five. And we'll see you for other. Team Manuel is.